guys, good afternoon, welcome to Michelle Creates channel. So for our first tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to create a simple website. So let's start. Uh, this is what it looks like after you register. And then this is the name of my website, my existing website, Michelle Creates My Strikingly.com. We're gonna hit create new site. And then, we're going to select template to get started. So, we have different kinds of templates for business, for startup, for your store, uh, creatives, personal, blank, and etc. So, in this, in this section, these are the sample templates that we can use. And then, later on, I will show you how we're gonna tweak the graphics based on your preferences so i will choose um, business and then um let's try this crystal crystal template for a crystal jewelry shop start editing click the start editing so uh, in here, uh, you can you can change change the name based on your business. Let's say I'll just use my first name, Michelle Jewelry. Okay, so we have home collection, sign up, contact. This in this part, we can change the color based on your based on the palette of your brand so let's try this one change the font color to um, brown i choose brown because it looks aesthetic ish and then this is the uh the logo so for now i uh, i'll choose not to change it i'll stick with what is given in the template so we have the home section collection sign up and contact section so in this part uh, you can click image link and then you will you can upload the image the logo that you want or edit the image or remove image if you if you prefer not to put image that's fine then we can try to click edit image so we have filters here no thanks and then we can change the brightness Saturation, contrast, threshold, distance. Okay, and save. There. After that, you can change. Um, you can. Put your tagline or slogan here. Let's say um, your fancy jewelry. Go to go to store. Then ah, wrong spell. Your fancy jewelry. Go to store. Mm. Fancy and affordable. Jewel list. So let's assume that this is my slogan. Click save. Okay. Uh, in this um, in this part, 
you can click each and then you can change the name then you can edit the name uh, but for me I prefer not to change it anymore and then the sign up contact so yeah well, let's go back to the home and then you can also change the font style there uh, these are the font style available where you can choose from there you go okay after that um, by the way in this in this section you can change the grid on your preferences that, something like that one by one two by two and then you can change it either medium like, like that large extra large I prefer extra large so we'll, we'll save that okay and then add title add title mm -hmm. okay just ignore this part same with this Next, the next one is the collection. In this part, um, you can change it. Uh, new collection, something like that. And then you can change the background. These are the colors available. So, if you can see here in my name, the font color that I chose was brown. So, we have to uh, make it consistent. The brown palette that we're aiming for. So, I choose um, the shade that is very close to brown i'll choose this one and then you will click save but for this you can custom you can change if you don't like what was suggested you can click custom and then there are more options here okay so just click this and then click save whenever you're going to change uh, on the given template, don't forget to hit the save button. And then in this part, you can add photo of your of your collection, something like that. And then, okay. Sign up. I'll stick with this color and the font style as well as the background and then for inquiries uh, just um, put the store details of your shop in, in here so we have here um, the name of the client, email, the message, then they're just going to hit submit. And in this part is the um, map of our store. So you can, uh, you can either include your location map in here or just click the cross sign and then after that you can you can change this as well the layout click layout there 
we have layout B. We have four options. Layout A. Layout B. Did you see the difference? In layout A, when you click layout A, the socials is centered. Layout B. Layout C. Layout B. Hmm, I like this one. So, let's click the save. After that, hmm, you're good to go. You have to click publish. Excuse me. Uh, this will be your URL next. Publish now. Okay. Click the URL. There. There you go. Can you see? It's so um, user friendly. In just 10 minutes, you can build your own website. Okay. So, if you want, if let's say you're not contented of the result, you can always go back to the You can always go back here and then tweak some, do some changes, adjustments and colors and fonts, the images, the, if you want to add um, new sets of item collections, feel free to do so. So yeah, that's it. Hope you like this tutorial and click for more. Please don't forget to subscribe comment like to my channel comment more so we can create more tutorials thank you and bye bye